Well, thank you very much. Uh, the horrific uh, events of yesterday demonstrate that, unfortunately, war crimes are going on in Syria, that international humanitarian law uh, remains being violated frequently. Uh, the Security Council will, mean, will meet today. We have been asking for accountability in relation to the crimes that are committed, and I'm confident the Security Council will live up to its responsibilities. At the same time, these events only prove how important this conference is, how important it is to bring together the international community to be able to put pressure on the parties to the conflict and on the countries that have influence on the parties to the conflict to uh, put aside their differences and understand that there is a fundamental need to put an end to this horrific war, to make sure that in Astana a real ceasefire uh, is implemented and monitored, to make sure that in Geneva peace talks have substance and move forward for a political solution. And at the same time, let's not forget uh, the need for the international community to assume their responsibilities. And uh, this has been the uh, most important initiative of the European Union in relation to this, uh, in order for effective humanitarian aid to be provided to the Syrians. Syrians are far suffering horribly inside Syria, and the Syrian refugees go on with very, very terrible situations. And at the same time, for the international community to express a much more effective solidarity to host communities building their resilience and to refugee hosting countries that need budget support, structural support in their investments in relation to water, sanitation, education, health. These countries uh, are bringing their people to uh, create a global public good supporting Syrian refugees, and they have had until now not enough solidarity for the international, uh, from the international community. Okay. So I hope this conference will be a very clear signal of the commitment of the international community to the Syrian people and the, the commitment also to those countries around Syria that have been so generous with Syrian refugees.